Get your own spot, man. Come on, man. Come on. Dude, come on, man. Get your own spot, man. I... What the fuck? Come on. Get your own spot. Come on. Come on, man. Uh, what the? Oh, oh, fuck. Come on. Oh. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, oh, fuck. Good morning, Mr. Jesus, Jesus, you have quite a history here, I see. Five counts of public intoxication, one count of assault, and one count of indecent exposure. Hey man, I was just trying to change clothes. Okay, fair enough. And finally, one count of first degree attempted murder, for which you spent five years and were released under false conviction. Yeah man, some crazy shit, you know. What you just like to say, wrong place, wrong time. Alright, Jesus. Well, your luck just ran out. Hey, girl, you will not believe what this food did. Hold up, there's some creepy shit going down by the bridge. I'll call you back. Yo, what the fuck? 911? Yeah, I think I just saw a murder. So you said you stumbled upon the body? Yeah, man. Like I said, it's creepy. I've never found a dead body before in my life, and it's not like in the movies. Well, Jesus, why did you run? What, what else was I supposed to do? Look, Jesus, I'm gonna need you to tell me the truth, or else this isn't a good look for you. I mean, it's already going pretty bad for you. Look, man. I was just minding my business. My shit was all over the place from the rain last night. I Then I seen this guy, your body, whatever. I thought he was stealing my shit, you know, sleeping on my bed, you know. So I go over there to this guy and I'm getting kind of worried because, you know, he ain't speaking, he ain't moving. So I try to wake him up. Nothing. And when I turned him over, he was he just felt cold. What did the body look like? Looked like the guy got shot twice in the chest. Looked like he might have been there for a while. The blood was all dried up. Was there a gun? Uh, no. I didn't see a gun. All I saw was him. Actually, I did see a belt, but it looked like a woman's belt. Looked like he put up a fight, but maybe he was with someone else. What do you mean? I mean, well, the belt didn't look like a man's belt. It looked like a woman's belt. Seems like he might have had some company. Good morning. I just saw a dead body. How do you think I'm doing? And that's why you're here. Um, I just want you to tell me exactly what happened. Listen, it is too early to be messing with the popo, but this is how it went down. I was on my way to my homegirl Gata's house. I was talking with her on the phone, catching up or whatever, and I hear some spooky shit going down by the bridge. So I looked over and there's this homeless guy poking a dead body with a stick. So I call 911 and now I'm here. Okay. So we think that you might actually know who the body was. You guys went to high school together and um, I'm gonna show you a photograph of him. So tell me if you know who it is. Oh my God, yeah. His name's Tony. We had some classes together in high school but we were never close. Um, last time I heard, he went to the police academy, but I didn't know his girlfriend. Okay. 
Um, what's his girlfriend's name? Her name's Jocelyn. She got involved with this creepy guy in high school, but she got out of that. She ended it after he started getting violent, but I don't know if she was ever really able to get rid of him. He seemed like the stalker type. Mm -hmm. But Tony seemed to be good for her. But I kind of felt bad for the guy, you know, she had a lot of baggage. Okay. Well, do you know what the echo's name is? I think his name was Tajo. I killed him, but not her. Torture me all you want, but you can't make me confess what I don't know. I won't keep anything from you. Yesterday I saw him. I saw her. My ex, Jocelyn. She looks so beautiful. That's when I decided she needed to be mine again. Even if I had to kill that mook boyfriend of hers. You see, to me, killing isn't all that bad. Am I the only one that kills people?